This is a very sparkly box. DirectX 11, physics by NVIDIA, GeForce 3D Vision ready. Hi. I was thinking about just reading the back of the box. There's some reviewers online, they basically just read the back of the box and put a picture of the card online. How could they do that? It's a sparkle, GTX 580. Very sparkly box, very sparkly wolf, very sparkly video. Do we have any sparkles that I could put on? I'll add some sparkles in. I've got a sparkle right here. <laughs> Sparkle GTX 580. A lot of you may not be familiar with Sparkle. The Sparkle is not as massive in America as they are in other parts of the world like China and Europe. Uh, Sparkle, I want to say this about Sparkle because someone scoffed when I said Sparkle because they didn't know. They were like, oh, it's not an EVGA. It's not an, we, don't, we don't know who they are. Sparkle has a, um, they make all their own cards. 40% of their personnel uh, is actually R&D. So these guys, they really put a lot into their graphics cards. This one has some really interesting, uh, really interesting cooling device on it. It's nice. Let's talk about what this card is in particular. You guys know what a GTX 580 is. It's been out for a while, but I want to cover it anyway. Let's go through the specs. Okay, this GTX 580 uses the GF110 core. Uh, it's 40 nanometer technology. Uh, so this one has 512 processor cores, or you can, some people call them CUDA cores. Uh, and the processor clock is at 1544. The overall core clock is at 772 megahertz. Also has uh, 1.536 gigabytes of DDR5. That's GDDR5 and the uh, memory clock is at 4,008. That's what that's clocked at. It's a 384-bit card, very large uh, bandwidth, very nice, PCI Express 2.0, and the uh, memory bandwidth on this is 192 gigabytes per second. Okay, let's take a look at the ports. Over on this side, we have two DVI that supports 2560 by 1600, and there's a display port there as well that also supports 2560 by 1600. Keeping it simple over here. Moving on along, I want to note that you need an 8-pin and a 6-pin PCI Express adapter. They do have um, one adapter in the box. I'll show you that in just a second. Uh, take a look at the cooling unit here. Got their signature Wolf on there, purple color. No, you're not going to really be seeing that much. It's got sort of a bluish purple, actually. What would you call that, Jimmy, blue or purple? I'd call that lavender. Lavender, yes. Yeah. Lavender. Sparkle, lavender. Hmm. Okay, let's benchmark. Crisis Warhead at 1920x1200, DirectX 10, everything in max. The GTX 580, 39 frames per second. The 6970, 36 frames per second, and the GTX 480 at 34 frames per second. Pretty close race. Metro 2033, GTX 580, 36 frames per second. 6970, 27 frames per second. GTX 480, 28 frames per second. Battlefield Bad Company 2. The GTX 580 at 68 frames per second. Radeon HD 6970, 75 frames per second. And the GTX 480, 54 frames per second. Okay, here's what's in the box. There's a lot of stuff. Let's start all the way over here. Quick install guide. Just basically just says, just shove it in there and hit it with a hammer and then it'll work. And don't do that. Okay, there's a DisplayPort cable. Driver disc, download the newest ones, unless you really want to use that or you don't have internet connection. Two six pin. 2-1, 8-pin, that's for your PCI Express power. We have DVI to VGA. We, and we also have two Molex, 2-1, 6-pin PCI Express adapter. Now this is not the fastest GPU in the world anymore. The 590 and the uh, 6990 have surpassed this card, but it's still a $500 card around that area, maybe a little less than 500 right now, and you're gonna get what you pay for with this card. It is very fast, Sparkle, like I said, they make all their own cards, and with 512 CUDA cores, you're gonna be able to do a lot. This is gonna replace the Quadro in a lot of workstations if you're doing video editing. If you're doing 3D, maybe go ahead and get a Quadro, but if you're doing just video editing, rendering, uh, and you wanna be able to do it live in the timeline or have like live rendering in the timeline with Premiere, this is a very good way to go. If you're getting ready for Battlefield, think about one of these as well. I'll see you next time. For more information on the Sparkle GeForce GTX 580, locate a search box. Any search box will do. And type S15-0580.